everybody and welcome to the channel. My name is Ricky and I am what's known as a reseller. That is my job, that is how I earn my living. Predominantly eBay, Vinted, any platform, wherever I can get the cash, I'm there trying to sell my goods. Right here, right now, I'm gonna be diving into one of the most popular questions that I get, especially from those of you who just watch the channel but don't resell yourselves. And that is, how easy is it to start selling online? Whether you've got a closet full of clothes or a drawer full of unused gadgets, or you just wanna make some extra cash, platforms like eBay and Vinted make it super simple to get started. So if you're ready to turn your stuff into some extra cash, stick around. First up, why should you even bother selling online? Well, it's not just about decluttering your space, although it is fantastic when you do start to clear some space ready for you to fill it again with some more, some more junk. But it's about making money from things that you no longer need. And trust me, the process is way easier than you think. All of us resellers out here acting like it's the hardest job in the world. No brick and mortar stores, no massive overhead costs, just you and your phone and a few simple steps. Let's start with eBay. You've probably heard of it. It's one of the biggest platforms for selling anything from electronics to clothing to collectibles. It's great for items that have value and might be in demand outside of your local area. Setting up an account takes less than five minutes. Just create a username, upload your details and boom, you're ready to sell. One of the best things about eBay is that you can either list items for auction, which I normally do with high demand or rarer items, or you can set what's known as a buy it now price for an instant sale. Vintage process is also super simple. Open up the app, upload the photos that you want to sell, write in your title, again, just keeping it nice and simple, but obviously expand as and where you need to. Same with the description. Don't leave anything out that's gonna hinder the sale. Move into the category, it auto populates the categories for you. Sometimes you've gotta change it around. Select your brand, select the size of the item, Select the condition, very important. You can select the material if you want to, but it's not massively necessary. Then you need to select your price and then the parcel size, small, medium, or large. This case, medium, and then just upload it. Boom, one listed to Vinted. Repeat the process. Before you get started, here are some pro tips to make sure that you get your item sold fast. High quality photos are everything. Now you don't need to have a studio, you don't need to have the best camera, you just need to have a good camera with a good clean background, no junk going on, you don't want your cup of tea sitting next to the product or a bacon sandwich or on the bed, none of those photos. Even though people do still sell with those kinds of photos, I wouldn't advise it. You need to get pictures of the item from multiple angles, keeping it clean. Show everything. Make sure your descriptions are clear and to the point and make sure you mention any flaws honestly. Buyers appreciate the transparency, and you may be able to hide it in the picture, but as soon as that item arrives on their doorstep, they're gonna see it, and it's gonna come back to you. You're gonna have a return, maybe a ding on your account, and you might even be out of pocket the postage. So just be honest. If you've got a flawed item, lower the price, sell it cheaper, show the flaw. You gotta price it right as well. There are many ways that you can check the market value on some products. For example, you can go to eBay, go into the tab section on the right hand side, click the sold tab and the completed tab. And then what that's gonna do is bring up a range of that item that you're searching for, which has sold, the transactions gone through, and then it's gonna give you an idea of how many have sold and when, so you can gauge the price. If there's 10 that have sold in the last month for 40 pound, then you can confidently assume that your average price that you should be listing that item for is around about 40 pound. There are so many more things that you can dive into when it comes to researching prices, but we're gonna keep this simplified for today. This is for the seller who's never sold before. Not for you professionals. So there you have it. Selling on platforms like eBay and Vinted is super easy, and you can have your items listed in under 10 minutes. Whether you're looking to make this a side hustle or just clearing out your closet, these platforms make it super accessible for you to sell your items. I'm not your average how-to education channel. Reselling is what I do, so you see all those aspects. Car boot sales, charity shops, hints and tips whenever I can. I'm not a guru, but I'll teach you what I can. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and drop a comment down below with any questions or experiences that you've had selling online. I'm off to go and get these on their way to their new home. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. I think the next video will talk about good packaging skills. See you in a bit.